everybody, welcome back to Logical Gamers. I am currently moving around, that's why you can hear chains and everything, because, you know, I wear chains, because I'm a fucking emo kid. <laughs> Alright, so, we're still continuing. Um, I guess we could have just been practicing off-screen, but we weren't. So, yeah, uh, that's true, we could have been. So, uh... But then we would miss valuable yeah. growth. Like, like right seven. there, right there. You can see. Oh, oh, it. No oh. big deal, it doesn't matter. You'll see it pretty much anytime you level up. Yeah, I know. Uh, I was just gonna explain Wait, to you a bit more. Yeah, every time you level up, you see shit like that, man. Oh, right. I don't Yeah, so your special attack is now up to 15, and your speed is 16. Yeah. So pretty much, you want a base dildo around uh, <laughs> being fast and able to shoot things. Yes! So, <laughs> it worked out perfectly in the end. Um, yeah, so any distance attacks that he'll get, that's what you'll want to work on, because those are special attacks. So, like, elemental ones, rather than, like, scratch or tackle or whatever the fuck. Uh, quick attack, yeah. bite, all that stuff. Actually, I'm not sure about bite. It might be a physical attack Wait. instead of a special attack. You know how but you something like absorb right there, that's a special attack. Yeah, I know, because it's his like own type move, right? Y yes. It, a special attack is just one that is like a non-contact one, I believe. Like one that's distance. I could oh. be wrong, but I'm oh, pretty like, sure like that it's a range it's, attack. So like, um, uh, I like this. I like. Hmm, I forget the name of it. I might be saying the wrong thing, but Thunder Fang or something like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's a move? Yeah. Maybe? Yeah, Yeah, because they have like Ice Fang and yeah, Fire okay. Fang. Yeah, those are physical moves still. Yeah, yeah. they're elemental. Cause, yeah, because they're like... Rather than a distance move, I believe. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty and, sure. And yeah. Range. yeah, I'm I, pretty I sure the range is special attack. So... You know it would be awesome? What? To see if we into a shiny Pokemon. We don't have Pokeballs. Not, not right now. Not right now. Yeah. I, I was oh, gonna say, that fuck. would really suck at start game. I really hope I just I didn't just jinx that. Eh, the chance of getting one is impossible. So no, it's not. <laughs> it's not. I know. This is the first game I ever, I ever caught my shiny. Hmm. Yeah. Same cartridge? No, oh, I was actually. Say, yeah. It wasn't. Yeah. Uh, so here, here's a good story about my original cartridge. Well, it's not. It's actually a really shitty story. Okay. It, it's a good story of how shitty it is. If that makes sense. Okay, okay so it. okay, so back in like 2010, 2000, maybe like 2011, I was still in high school and I was wanting to go to. I, I I'm pretty sure like I briefly told you this story. Probably. Story. But I wanted to go to Warp Tour, and if nobody oh, yeah. knows what Warp Tour is, it's like a music festival that travels all around uh, North America, or like mainly around the U.S. and then into Canada, like in, like into like a Toronto. Our bigger cities. Yeah. yeah, like the bigger cities, like Toronto, Montreal, I think. Cause we're Canadian, eh? Yeah. And so, I'm just gonna go from Battle Man. Okay, might as well. Anyways, so, um, tr uh, I think Warp Tour is like $60 for a ticket. Just remember, don't name drop anyone. No, just say, uh, buddy. Know, I, I, yeah. That's how we do things. <laughs> no, I know. Anyways, so I was saving up money, and I sold a bunch of stuff. Like, I sold like all the Lego from my childhood, which is a horrible mistake. I wish I still had Lego. I want to uh, make like a bunch of like, 8-bit figures, like I want to make like Dude, Mario yes. and Link and all that. That'd be so cool. And so I, I sold like a huge PS2 bundle with like, like a bunch of games. Like one of them was like Final Fantasy 12, I think Guitar Hero 3, which isn't worth much, but I mean like it's, it's one of the best Guitar Hero games. Yeah, Legends of Rock was pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Um, anyways, it was like the silver, the silver PS2 Slim. Like I that sold, one? Yeah. I sold it all for like... Thirty-five dollars, which is a horrible, horrible price. Not for not for them, but for me. At the time, I wasn't aware of how much it should have been worth. Pretty much, in the past, like what three, four years, maybe five years, we've become like collectors, and there's all the stuff that we yeah. get when we're younger. We're like, fuck, we're retards. Yeah, like, we should have kept all that. You know, like, why do we do this to ourselves? Anyways, so one of the games that I actually had sold to go to Warp Tour was Pokemon Emerald, and uh, it was the first, um, actually, it was the second Game Boy Advance game that I actually ever owned. And uh, see, the reason why I sold it was because it was actually cracked, like the the casing was cracked, and I'm pretty sure the internal battery was also dead as well. And so I sold it for like five bucks, but I shouldn't have because it's just it was like a nostalgic item for me. And uh, anyways, I sold it. I earned like enough money to go, and the friend who I was supposed to go with. Um, he was like, oh yeah, man, I'll totally give you a ride for sure. Just like, just get the money for the ticket. So I earned all the money for the ticket, and he bailed on me like a day before Warped in Toronto. 
I was so pissed. So I didn't get to go. And I lost out on all of those things that I sold. Wait, where am I going? Oh yeah, I'm just, I guess I can heal if I want to. Yeah, you didn't go to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, why not? But anyways, yeah, I was so pissed. I yeah, sold go to the lab. a bunch of good shit that I, that I owned as a kid. Yeah, I'm trying to rebuild my collection of what I had as a kid. Yeah. It really sucks when you move out of your parents' place, you really realize how little you truly do have. Actually, like I had a lot. Well, I mean, video game-wise, when you have siblings. Oh, yeah. Well, a lot of the video games were my brother's well, and mine, I so sisters, I just let them keep it. I had sisters, and I'm not saying that like, girls aren't into video games because my girlfriend is, but my my sisters were definitely not into video games. Whereas my brothers are. I literally gave my little brother my Xbox 360. Yeah. Because I had, like, a roommate at, for a little while. She We don't have her anymore because she moved out. But when we were using her Xbox, because it was one of the Xbox Slims, or 360 Slims, and it was way better, right? Because it didn't overheat or anything like that, like mine did, and it played faster. Mm -hmm. Right, like it actually was up to date. They yeah. had an original arcade, right? What? Like the original arcade system, like uh, Xbox 360 arcade, didn't come with a hard drive, didn't come with any of that. So the the hard drive was like bought separate. And uh, I was like, all right, well, I don't. Oh my god, I need it fast. Anymore. Oh man, oh man. I was like, all right, so I don't need this anymore. Like I'll just give it to my little brother because yeah. he doesn't have an Xbox, and my other little brother has the family Xbox. Okay. So that way they both have an Xbox, and they don't need to. Pretty much Wait, ever see each other. Can you do me a favor? For sure, man. Can you pull up the Sanic theme song? No. I can't move. Fine, I'll put Wait, it in post I... No, post editing, I'll do it. Just. I'll do Sick. it. No, don't I'll do it. it. Fucking, I'll do it when editing, man. Okay, ready? Okay. Right. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> now, okay. All the way. Oh, damn. Now. You'll get what I added in, that is all. <laughs> because that is copywritten. So I'll have to fucking change it around a little bit so it'll sound different. No, 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 do the MLG for the one. Like, the one that's, like, highly, okay, highly fine. distorted. That one. Uh, <laughs> fine, I'll do that. Thank you, Josh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Make my editing more annoying. At least it's better than that time that Jason said something racist and I had to oh censor him. Oh my god, what did he s Well... He didn't say it without, or with thinking. Because, cool. okay. to make a long story short, our one friend is black, and he has given us permission to say the n-word with him because, you know, okay. it's just, you get yeah. that permission from them because they yeah. think it's funny, yeah. right? Well, he said it in a video, oh my so God. I had to censor it because he was there with us because he's also part of Rage Arcade. Uh -huh. And it was just so, I was like, God damn it, Jason, now I have to edit. So for the actual video... Uh -huh. Our other friend, like our other friend Alex, he was yeah. in that video as well. It was one of our Sonic um, Heroes videos. Mm -hmm. And at the beginning, he said, bite the pillow, I'm going in dry. But he has a very, like, manly, weird voice uh -huh. for it. So what did I do? I sampled that, and I, re I played it over top of the oh. thing. <laughs> nice. So, literally, it's like, oh my god, you're dry! And that was all it was. And then I... A bunch of people were like, why the fuck did you do that in your video? And I was like, because I was covering over something. If you watched, like, the next ten seconds, you would have known why. Yeah. I had to censor it. And I even explained what I was going to censor it with. So, uh... Yeah. It's well, just... Because you don't think about it, right? When you're with your friends, yeah. right? And they've given you permission to say that word, and you're like, okay, well... You don't think that you're being recorded anymore, because you completely forget. Yeah. So... It happened. Yeah. Shit happens. We all thought it was funny. But, um... Like, even our buddy, like, we are See, when you're with your friends, you can make certain jokes. Right? Oh, of course. But when you're on the internet, you can't. Oh, of Well, you forget that you know, you're you... on the internet when you're with your friends. Yeah, well... So, um, we were making jokes at him as well, and he was making... I even said something that people might have taken out of context, but I was just speaking about the people around me. <laughs> I wasn't speaking about people on the internet. Yeah. Because they said something, right? Well, Jason's Irish, Jenna's Italian. He is. Yeah, Jason's no Irish. No way. Yeah, Jason's Irish, but like he's I think second or third generation here. Okay. But um, yeah, make to uh, make another long story short, uh, his family is a quote unquote royal type family from there that broke off into two different branches. Really. His is the more royal side, but they're not royal anymore because the queen took over type thing, you know, of because as much as Ireland and whatnot, it's all of its own. Um, can he, can he it's speak a, in a? In a in a, uh, accent? Yes, oh but he God. doesn't really need to because like his dad doesn't have it because he's been here his like his whole life. Yeah. So yeah, I think Jason's like 
third generation here. Hmm. So yeah, so he doesn't really have the accent, but his his grandfather does. But um, so I said like, fuck Irish people, fuck Italian people, and then like I looked at my black friend, I was like, fuck black people, fuck white people. Oh, and I'm saying man. all these things, right? And they're all laughing their asses you might off, have to right? Edit that one out too. No, that was a long time ago, and uh, nobody <laughs> watches our videos anyways. And uh, so I said all of that, and they all were laughing at it. I was like, you guys can't say shit to me. Like, I'm only an eighth native, so if you say something like, uh, fuck native people, I'll only be an eighth offended, because I'm white. Like, other than that, right? Because I'm seven, because I'm like, my dad is quarter, so, or, and that makes me an eighth, because his dad was half, right? Mm -hmm. So. Wait, really? Yeah, so I'm one eighth native. Oh. So I was like, only an eighth of me gets offended. So my one native <laughs> friend, Chris, he says, um, he's full native, right? So he'll yeah. say shit. And I'll be like, yeah, I only, only an eighth of me got that. Can you explain it for the rest of me? Right? And like, he'll just be like, get the fuck out of here. And I'm like, yeah, well, it's sort of like, you can sort of call me like a Métis in a way. And he's like, no, because you're not French. I'm like, bonjour. And he's like, get the fuck out of my country. And I'm like, it's my country now. I'm mostly white. And it's just one of those type of situations because, you know, you're with your friends, right? And you say shit like oh, that. Yeah. Right? So, yeah, we, we, have our, we have our issues with me and the censorship sometimes on here. So that's why I... Watch the videos two or three times while editing, like because I watch it the first time while making fixes to it with editing. So yeah. I'll have to like cut out slight bits so that the video and audio sync up. Usually I don't have to, but sometimes. And then I watch it again after I've fully done it. So I've watched from like the intro all the way to the outro of it, and then after I'm done and it's been exported, I watch <laughs> it to see if there's any problems at all. Yeah. Right. So normally if I miss something, I go fuck, and I'll bring that just that completed file back in, then I'll censor it that way. Yeah. So it's a lot less things for it to need to render. So. But. Something I was going to mention about censorship. Not exactly censorship, but like, I guess like inside jokes and like racial slurs and stuff. My girlfriend, she, uh, she has a German heritage. Mm -hmm. And uh, she'll always talk about how like she's a descendant or something from like Hitler. <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay. Okay. All right. Well, is she blonde? Uh, she her natural hair color, hair color is like dirty blonde. Then she's not really a descendant of Hitler unless he, like he had an offspring with like a blonde person because he had brown hair and brown eyes. Yeah, I know. So he's actually Jewish. No, he wasn't Jewish. His father was Jewish. Okay, okay. Well, a part of I believe, his one of his parents was Jewish and he didn't yeah. like them. But that wasn't his reasoning for disliking the Jews in World War Two. He thought they failed them in World War One because he got gassed in World War One, and he was like blind for like a month or something like that. Do you know that. what he actually like? No, what, do you know what his part was, World War One? Um, yes, he was just a random soldier at the time. He was actually like a messenger boy. What? Yeah, yeah, I, I learned that in like grade 10 history. Yeah, hmm. uh, he was actually like a messenger boy or something, and like, I don't know. I can just imagine like little Hitler. Because I know he was in like his 20s or something like that, because he was like, I'm pretty sure he was in his 40s during World War Two, and World War Two was only like maybe... Fuck, I should be... This is gonna make me sound really bad if I don't know the time. I'm gonna say 10 years at most. Mm-hmm. have a difference between the two. I can just imagine little Hitler, like, Remember arriving with messages like, oh, I'm gonna bust Hmm. I don't know why I pictured him gay. Yeah, he probably was. <laughs> he probably was. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Anyone could be gay if they try hard enough, I mean... <laughs> yeah, I suppose. He just gotta... Apparently, as what the straights say, you can choose to be gay. Well, why don't you choose? To I don't. Be? I don't believe that. No, it's not possible. It's just your orientation. You don't really choose who you love. You just kind of love them. You know what? That's why I'm stuck Fuck with Gabby. Because so I didn't choose it. Thug life chose me. <laughs> but uh, yeah. There's no berries it. up here now. Okay, good. You say bears? Berries. Oh, I was like, I don't think there are bears aside from like Teddy Ursa and Ursa Ring. Is there? Like, not in third gen, at least. They're not, but you can not catch them. You can. Yeah, in, like, in the Safari Zone. After, like, a certain point in the game, I think it's, like, after the, like, the Pokemon League, you can go to the Safari Zone, and there's, like, a whole other, se whole other section, like, opens up, and you can catch, um, second generation. Huh. Yeah. So, yeah, I wonder, is that playing... The cartridge is in the back of that, right? No. No? It's in the, it's in the game adapter. Why would you, or the, the Game Boy Advance adapter? Where at? I'm trying to find where it Down is. Down here. Oh, okay, yeah. I can see that. All right. I was gonna say because maybe we oh, could damn. possibly trade between them, right? Uh, no. 
No, no you can't. But that would be cool. But if you get your Game Boy with one of the um, Game Boy Advance games, you can actually link it up. There's a link. Uh, okay, so we can trade. We can, but not yeah, yeah, not through the Game Boy. Okay, all right, so. all right. I was just really confused for a minute. Yeah, no, you're no PP that's... left in your dildo. Alrighty, well, I think that's about the end of this episode. That's roughly 15 minutes, give or take a bit. So, um... Alrighty. Yeah, thanks for watching, and we will see you guys on Lots of Gamers. Yeah, in, uh, probably tomorrow. I guess. Yeah. Peace out. For us, five minutes. Yeah, for us, five minutes. But this video probably won't go up for several weeks. But, uh, peace!